Hello everybody, welcome back to Robot Attack. My name is Scouterswan5, and today, uh, I just wanted to go through, are you ready for this, 104 wishlist items. I thought this might be a good idea. Yes, I'm Scouterswan5. This is my wishlist. Uh, so yeah, this is, um... Uh, I don't know. I I I I thought. <clears throat> excuse me. I I thought that it would be a good idea to go through all of these kind of right. Uh, file them. Uh, get rid of some. There's so many. Please send help. Uh, <laughs> and just see how it goes. I don't know how long this will take, but we'll we'll we'll. we'll I thought this would be a good idea. Uh, <clears throat> to to kind of go through all of these and um, kind of decide if they stay or should should they stay or should they go, uh, and then maybe we'll decide that first, and then and then maybe another video rank them. Um, so <laughs> so yeah, I I think that would be a good idea for now because um, ranking them might take. A little bit longer time so let's get started because we got a long I got all this list to, to go through uh, don't starve Hamlet yes we're keeping this for sure I I've been collecting don't starve uh, I've been a big fan of don't starve uh, I keep saying and you probably read my tweets that clay can do no wrong uh, this that's the developers of don't starve together um, or don't starve, uh, Clay Entertainment, uh, rhymes with clay, um, or rhymes with play, that's the word, that's some of what I meant. So yeah, they have all these releases, all of which are just fantastic. If you ever end up buying any of these, you won't be disappointed, so I'll, I'll keep, obviously, these to, um, uh, to, to... I, I do want to buy them because I always buy all the DLCs for Don't Starve, but I'm I'm behind. So uh, another thing, Don't Starve. Yes, we'll keep this too. Um, this is a new one, Prison Architect. Uh, they just released um, this DLC. It's a mixed review. I'm kind of nervous about it. Um, I don't even know. I didn't even really know what it adds. Um, uh, it, I, I, I don't know. I, I guess I could always look into it. Um, I mean, Prison Architect is a great game, so I think this might be fine, um, to, to, to get. I don't, let's see what the mixed reviews are. Uh, created by a developer. Um, wow. <laughs> All right. Um, it's not worth it. It was fun. Barely changes. Okay. So maybe, um, <laughs> wow. Alright, that's kind of, so maybe leave it, but probably, you know, um, probably wait to buy it. I'll probably put it lower on the list if people aren't, you know, excited about it. Um, yeah. Uh, there's also here Planet Zoo. So, um, which obviously I'm gonna get. Um, I think uh, another thing is to probably mark it lower. I was talking to my friend Smoking Ace about it. Um, how just there's glitches and things that need to be fixed in this game. Uh, and so there's there's some things i mean i i kind of want to hold off on this a little bit uh so i i'll i'll hold on on this i think i'll buy it regardless but you know pain i don't i don't want to like buy a game if it if there's like issues with it i mean i'm gonna like i said i wouldn't even if i buy it today um you know i'm sure they're gonna make fix some changes um yeah they're always 
I feel like they'll hopefully fix some of the issues in this game. Like I've I've been hearing like a lot of uh, animals have died. Um, somehow it's in the death cellar. Uh, I mean, I I wouldn't I wouldn't put it past it that it is probably the best seller. But you know, animals have died even though there's water. Uh, you know, in their area, um, there's also been glitches where like a panda escaped and other things. So I don't know. I'm gonna hold off on this a little bit. Maybe like I don't know a month or two and see where the game is at that point. Um, and then, you know, maybe watch a video. So I'll, I'll keep that. Um, Return of the Arbor Den. Yes, we're keeping that. Uh, so from the same makers of... Um, uh, same makers of... Whatchamacallit? Uh, Papers, Please. Oh, no. Well, I think it's similar. Let's see. I think it's same, uh, similar. Oh, Lucas Pope. Yeah, Papers, Please. I was alright. Yeah, ding. <laughs> I was I was getting confused of uh, not tonight, which you'll see shortly. But yeah, I heard really good things um, about this game. Uh, I it is a one time playthrough, um, <clears throat> and yeah, I mean, but once you play it, it I mean, it's it's a long game as well. So I guess I wouldn't mind keeping it uh, on sale. Uh, I'll probably buy it on sale, but I'm sure once I buy it on sale, I'm gonna be like, I I should have bought, I could have bought this at full price, and I heard so many good things about this, and I just like the retro style of it. Um, I should really click on the game so you see it. I just feel like you guys kind of know what these games are. I'm so behind on the on it, so I'm, I'm buying games as you can tell. Uh, Parkitect. I haven't played too much of it. Uh, There's a DLC here. Uh, I'm just clicking through the photos. I I, I would probably buy it. I I kind of play going back to Parkitect when I just don't feel like playing Planet Coaster. Uh, you know, and I just want a more relaxed game. So like, I don't know. Parkitect is a little bit behind on Planet Coaster, but honestly, like. Um, basically, uh, I feel like this DLC might be fine. Um, I'll probably wait till it's on sale as well. Uh, let's see, not tonight. Um, this is similar to Papers, Please, but you're a bar, um, bar hopper of a bar. And so, <clears throat> I wouldn't mind getting this as well. That's... Uh, Sounds like, um, um, yeah, it sounds like it's, it's, if I like papers, please, I'll, I'll probably like that. Um, it's really good. Uh, Crying Sons, I'll keep as well. Uh, if you don't know what Crying Sons are, uh, it's kind of like a FTL. This is a newish, kind of newish game. Um, uh, it's, yeah, it's like FTL, but you also, um, like, you only have one ship. It's not like, you know, where it's FTL, you get a different ship when you unlock things and stuff. So, I, I wouldn't mind uh, keeping this as well. Um, yeah, Resident Evil 2, I'll probably keep as well. I, it looks gorgeous. And a big fan. Uh, Resident Evil 4 is on my uh, is on my the number two of all time <laughs> ever game. Like my favorite game. So or no, number three. I don't I don't know anymore. Um, yeah, Resident Evil 2. Easy. I'd, I'd probably pick it up. Um, yeah, we're not doing good in eliminating any of these. Um, Jackbox, we're not going to go through all of these, but I'll, I'll probably pick these up, so keep these on. Slay the Spire. Um, mm, I don't know. I, I think I'd like it. Uh, just basically my friend told me I should get it to be better at deck building and... 
which would work out with anything in terms of like Hearthstone and stuff. Um, yeah, I guess I'll keep it, but probably we should probably, you know, make it lower on the list. Uh, <clears throat> I'll, I'll just kind of do that. Um, so the Rise of Industry uh, is kind of a uh, open TTD. Uh, uh, basically, um, if you don't know what Open TDT is, a transport tycoon kind of game. Uh, it's very, it's an indie developed game. A really beautiful game. Uh, there's a demo for it as well. So um, I played the demo a little bit. I'm still confused on it. So maybe I, I think what I should do is just watch a video. Um, I wouldn't mind buying this because it's just really nice uh, looking and honest I just like the art style and it's really like kind of blocky uh, I like it and a lot of stuff in the game that you could do look like look at how like how great this looks I like it um, so we'll keep it for sure uh, all, all of the DLC on Planet Coaster I didn't get um, of Planet Coaster, I still behind. There's one of them, I believe, that are is a mixed review that I think I deleted. Um, <clears throat> I think I got yeah, I got mostly positive. Uh, classic rides, uh, adventure pack. I keep saying this that <clears throat> that uh, I want to do like you want to buy stuff that would work in your park. Um, so like, I wouldn't mind maybe this adventure pack, because at least it kind of, like, I like the pirate stuff. This kind of adds um, more tropical kind of looking things and boats, like these boats and stuff, um, and ruins. So I wouldn't mind that for sure. Uh... Um, yeah, I, I don't know. I, I think I'll keep this, but like I, I'll probably hesitate on some of these other ones for a little bit. Um, like this one, I don't really need. Just adds more rides, which I guess wouldn't be a bad thing. Um, no, it's kind of it's kind of nice to get more rides. Um, let's see. So extra punks, I probably I like it. I mean. I probably won't ever get this, so I probably could delete this, honestly, because it's just, it's from the makers of Zachtronics. Um, uh, if you don't know what Zachtronics are, they're, they're just basically like, oh, you think, you know, Dark Souls 3 is, or no, <laughs> it's like, it's like the Dark Souls 3 of uh, thinking uh, puzzle games. Uh, these are very difficult, and... It makes your college degree look silly, uh, so I don't I don't know if I would probably enjoy it um, because I'm not very educated, <laughs> not very smart in terms of it's just kind of like hacking and stuff. Um, I I guess I I mean I would support Zach Electronics, but I I just I guess um, I guess I wouldn't. I don't think I, I might like play it at a friend's house, like if they allow me. But I don't think I'll ever play it. So let's remove our first removed of the list. That was I don't know. I think I think maybe later on, if if I play it at a friend's and I like it, I'll, I'll come back to it and and buy it. But um, until then, like you know, until then, I'll I'll just it uh elite dangerous um i don't even know what this game is this is this is a like a space space exploring game right uh, none of these pictures are coming up for some reason and i heard um it'd be wise to like um kind of use a joystick and stuff it's not really mandatory but uh, yeah, I don't, like, use a joystick. I, I think that would probably be a while until I buy one. The joysticks aren't that, I mean, they're like 30 bucks, right? So, 
I mean, I would, I guess if you want, like, more realistic, um, yeah, I, I would think, I, I don't know. I think using keyboard and mouse wouldn't be as, pretty much I'm a keyboard and mouse kind of guy, um, so I guess we could remove that, um, uh, we could always come back later once I buy a, a joystick or whatever. Um, I'm going to get a lot of hate in the comments, I feel, with some of these. It's fine. It's fine. I, I just trying to make it. Does it spark joy? Does it or does it not? Okay, get rid of it. Um, Far Cry 3, yes. It's, I don't even know if I have any Far Cry on here. Um, let's look at my games. Um, no, I don't. I, it seems fun, but, uh... I think I'd probably enjoy it more on, like, my PlayStation or something, but I don't, I don't know about computer. I'll keep it. <clears throat> I mean, I've been... <laughs> if I haven't bought it now, I don't think I'll ever play it, so... And I think I have some of them on it, so... Yeah, we'll... we'll I'll delete it. Uh, Divinity Original Sin, I heard actually this is better than the first one, so, and I have the first one, I just need to come back and play it again, so, I wouldn't mind keeping it, same thing with Pillars of Eternity, uh, not sure if it's better than the first one, but, uh, let me know, um, yeah, it, I definitely want to come back to both of these, uh, the first ones and play them through. I think I just need like a whole day to play them. Um, uh, I, I think that, um, yeah, I just need like a whole day or just like w waking up and just play Divinity Original Sin, the first one, and Pillars of Eternity. It's just one of those games that you just need hours of a day. And that's, that's never going to happen. Uh, maybe tomorrow. No. <laughs> uh, Cloud Punk. Um, <clears throat> I don't know when it's going to come out. Man, this has been forever. Uh, it's, I don't even know. It looks interesting. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Your delivery driver. Um, hmm. Um, it doesn't look as beautiful as I remember it. Um, I guess we could remove it. We could always add it later when we when we see like more games uh, or more, I guess, on it. Um, yeah. Um, so yeah, we'll come back. Dishonored two. Um, I have Dishonored one. I still need to complete. So, um, I think obviously when I complete that, I'll buy this. So I'll keep that. Uh, Convoy, um, also another similar to FTL, um, but you're a delivery driver, I think, yeah. An FTL, Mad Max, FTL. What wouldn't I like? We'll keep it, um, I, I know it's been in my wish list for a while, but like anything else. I thought I deleted you! Um, and I deleted you too. And I deleted you too. Uh, where's, is there any other ones? Oh, I don't think so. Yeah. Uh, convoy. I know it's been in my wish list a while. Added on three. It's been a while. I know I'm behind, but I know I think I'd probably enjoy it if I like FTL. Jalopity. That seems interesting. Um, it's kind of a, like a driving fix em up game. Uh, it's kind of cool. I don't know if I'll... Played a lot. 
Why why are these being Yes, I wanted to delete these. Why aren't these being deleted? This is not really working. Is it? I'm trying to go through these. And this is why I'm recording it, so um Yeah, I'll keep this. This seems fun. Uh gang beasts, um always bas basically uh, yeah, I'll keep this. But I think the only way um, to do that is if, if I have friends over kind of thing. I don't think I'll buy it offhand. Uh, Factorio uh, seems very fun. Uh, there's a demo that I believe I played. Um, it was pretty cool. It seems pretty fun. I don't know. Probably get a bit of it. I don't know. Uh, yeah, we're making some good strides here. Kerbal Space Program, yes, there's a second one coming out. Um, I, I know this has also been on my wish list for a while. Oh, there's just so many that I just need to buy now. This is so expensive. Curious Expedition, no, I don't need to. Turmoil, no, this is where things are going to get eliminated. Uh, Overland, uh, if you haven't seen, this is basically, I'm, I'm gonna not click on the games, um, because maybe that's affecting why there, it, that's why we're, you know, why it's not deleting. Um, but yeah, Overland is kind of like a zombie turn-based game, so I, it seems cool, like the graphics, um, uh, but I'm not sure why it's that... Is it not released yet? Um, that's interesting. Astroneer, I'll probably remove it. I I don't think I'll be interested. This is the police. Also, pit people. I don't even know why I have this on here. It looks like a turn-based game. So we could delete that too. Uh, Hot Lava. Um, it's the same makers of Clay. I don't think I'll play it though. Um, Lego Worlds, I'll uh, probably keep it, because <laughs> you can play, build Legos on the computer, yes I will. Far Cry 4, same thing, I think I'll just play on the computer. Um, so, then we got Alien Isolation, heard pretty good things about it. Um, I'll probably keep it, because... Um, it's, it's horror, and it's alien, so yeah, I'll probably keep it. Pixel Piracy, <laughs> yes, I'll probably delete this. Uh, Half-Life 2, 99 cents, why, why haven't I bought this yet? The only reason, right, I have this, is, uh... Um, is because that's the original Stanley Parable. That's really the only reason why, uh, that's the only reason why I would buy it. And for 99 cents, I don't think, I mean, I'll probably just buy it right now. <laughs> but yeah, I, I pretty much want to just play, um, Stanley Parable. Haven't played, don't, don't hate me, Half-Life or the first one or anything, so, yeah. Uh, Sonic Spinball, obviously you gotta keep it. Um, because it's a classic, it'd be nice to have it on the computer. Daisy, probably not. Um, get rid of, uh, Path of Progress. I don't even know what this game is, so let's delete that. Soma, I heard, is a pretty good horror game. But I don't know. 2015. Uh, Trackmania Stadium. Yeah, I used to play this a lot on, it was originally released. I think it was free. Uh, yeah. <sighs> Uh, so I, I think, I don't, I don't know if I'll ever play it, 
it's I think the demo has a good amount of I think it comes with the demo um, uh, yeah I'll, I'll have to see um, uh, let's let's get rid of it I don't think I'll ever come back to it I had a good time with it at the time um, not a really big fan of racing games so um, I think it would be idea to not do it. Uh, For Honor, probably not. Uh, this is similar to... Yeah, I'll keep this one. Uh, Eastside Hockey Manager. I think... I, I love hockey. Um, uh, I think I'll... I think this is... I like it, but it's more of a... <laughs> was like a GM mode. Uh, and I, I guess I don't really need to play it. I, I love hockey, but like, I'm not very good at like the GM mode and stuff like, and stuff like that. So, War Warhammer. I think I'll probably like this, but um, I, I think, um, I think that uh, basically I'll, I'll just wait on this. Um, kind of just like involves like a little bit more of a fantasy total war so I, I love the total war series so saints row 2 no i believe i have it on ps4 yeah battlefield galactica um i've uh, heard good things about it i might i'll have to look into it again and see uh bell shock i <laughs> know <laughs> shocking <laughs> I, I haven't played the first or second one. Uh, I played a little bit. I have these on... I have these on... Um, console. But um, it'd be good... If I want to get like real into these, I think playing on the computer would be a better idea. Um, hmm... Because I, I feel like we're integrated if I'm on keyboard and mouse. Outlast 2, um, seems like a pretty good horror game if I remember. Slime Rancher, seems cool. I don't think I'll be interested. Doom, yes, I'll probably keep that one. It's a, it's a good one. Uh, it's a good horror. And Wolfenstein, also a good one that I could I'd probably enjoy. Uh, the Crew, probably not. Uh... And then pray. Uh, seen good things. I don't know. Uh, keep it because I haven't seen like the ending of it. Um, and it seemed like it's a good horror um, puzzle game. Is it so? Portal Knights also been on my wish list for a while. I don't think I'll be interested. Tokyo Forty Two. No, this has been in a while. Orkishin seems fun, so I'll keep it. I know it's it's been for. It's been on it forever. When it's done. <laughs> wow. Oh yeah, Planet Coaster Back to the Future. Yeah, keep that. Freddy the Fish. Oh yeah. Uh Yeah, I'll keep that for sure. No questions. Like I played this. It took for, it's like the Dark Souls 3 of kids games. Uh <laughs> it took me forever as a kid to beat this. And I finally did. I kind of want to like go back and see if I could beat it again. That's kind of the only reason. And for two bucks, I mean, come on. Um, might be a good idea. Um, I really like. Was it? Uh, it is it? Um, who's the maker of this? So, uh. Man, you know, I, I want to click on it to see, but I I know it's going to mess it up. Uh, some, something Entertainment? Uh, they make all b bunch of games uh, that were in the kids' realm. Overland 2, 
Probably not. Um, it looks kind of cool, but I don't know if I'll ever play it. So let's get rid of that. Rock of Ages. Just like a boulder, crush them up game. Um, probably not. Mega Fall is just like a superhero game. This is kind of cool, but you could get these for free. I'm, I'm like playing on the internet. Um, so I'll delete that. Same makers of FTL into the breach. I'll keep that. Um, the need for speed hot pursuit. I, I've been, uh, I had Need for Speed 3 and I've been collecting uh, ever since and I'm just so behind and I, I don't think I'll ever get back into Need for Speed. I, I liked it when I was a kid. Again, I used to be into racing games because I had, like that was my only, like, only game I had was Need for Speed 3. Um, so I'll just remove it. Uh... Far Cry 5, same thing. I'll just pretty much anything Far Cry Minute. Uh, it's been on my wish list for, I'll say a while, but it says 2018. Um, you have to do, like, you could do things in a minute and, like, things. Uh, yeah. Uh, I don't think I'll keep it. I'll delete it. Uh, Frostpunk, I'd probably keep it. It's like a steampunkish survival game. Um, Mother Brick in the Mall, it's like a mall simulate building game, so that'd be fun. Um, big fan of uh, building games. Overcloud, over crowd, same thing. Uh, it's like a building. I, was, I think it's a. You mean them up? It's just making people on the buses uh, keep it. Stardew Valley, mm, probably not. Uh, uh, City State, I don't even know what that game is. Cult of Simulator, I heard I should play it and I don't know what it is but I'll probably remove it. I don't, I don't need it. Warhammer, gonna delete it. Mirror's Edge, um, probably delete it as well. Uh, oh yeah, this game was fun. Uh, I remember this as a kid. I had the CD of this. Uh, build a, um, you try to build an empire on pizza, and then you could like put cockroaches and stuff on it. It's really weird. Um, I don't think I'll ever buy it though. I just, I just want it for nostalgia effect. Um, Tread nuts and don't even know. Uh, uh, Sniper Elite 3. Heard this one might be a little bit better than what I have. I have Sniper Elite 4, but just, ca just Cause 4. Don't think that will ever run on my computer. Battlefield, Bad Company. Um, I don't know. I, I do would prefer like a war game. I, I played this a little bit, but uh, I don't know if I'll ever... Yeah, I'll play it later. Uh, Mega Aquarium. Uh, I build an aquarium. <laughs> so yeah, I, I, that sounds cool. Uh, I don't know what this is. Nighog. Probably delete it. Uh, Command and Conquer. Red Alert. Uh, I think I just heard things about it. Mm, I'll keep it for now. Tower Elite. Oh yeah, this is just like another Gary's mod. Um, so, I don't know. Like a newer Gary's mod. Sinking Shitty. I gotta keep. This is a uh, kind of a uh, Call of Cthulhu game. Uh, Terraforming Mars. Um, I like the board game. It's really fun. Um, if... Uh, if, if, if you haven't played the board game, play the board game because this is really fun. So I, I don't know if this is single player. It'd be good to look into. 
Hitman. I haven't played any of the Hitman series, so I think I think I'd enjoy it. Um, I think it'd be kind of fun. Worms. I used to have worms. Uh, <laughs> I need to get that checked out. Hey, oh, uh, basically, I I had worms. I don't know. I had I had a 3D version. The 3D version. That was fun. Uh, but. Yeah, it'd be good to play Worms again. I had a lot of fun. Um, Grand Fifth Auto. I'd probably never play it. Um, uh, trying to think. Like, I don't think I'd enjoy it. Golf it. Uh, yeah, I'll keep. Uh, I think I, I enjoy golf with your friends, so it'd be another good one. Shortest trip to Earth. Another FTL. I've been seeing a, a consistent, um, a consistent theme here. So I I don't know. I I guess I'll look into it again. Um, yeah, I th I think I don't know if I'll Automo Chef. I don't know. I'll, I'll put it keep it for a little bit. I didn't really narrow down any, did I? Hundred and four. Yeah. Um. Am I, are you sure I'm deleting these? <laughs> uh. Anyways, Automa Chef I'll keep, and then this one. I just thought I just saw <laughs> it's pretty cool. Never played as a kid, um. So, and then that's coming soon. So yeah, there you go. Bam. And still at a hundred and four. Look at that. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. Hey, 64. Sweet. There you go. Alright, well, uh, I think this is a good place to end. I think next time we'll just go through this and, and rank them. Uh, so that way I could kind of focus on like buying the ones I want first. And yeah, we'll come back. So if you want to see more, hit the like and subscribe. Appreciate it. Alright, thanks. Love you. Bye.